Hello, this is not a spring chicken. The president is finding out that, boy, he is in trouble in all 50 states and nobody's wanting him. But speaking about not wanting people, even Republican entertainers are discovering that, oh, an appearance at a Democratic function may not have them wanted at the Republican function, even to perform. Yes. Take that. <laughs> I know, I'm laughing. Just wait till you hear the names. Well, for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. I love this camera. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, yeah, because um, they're going to they're going to crush the Republican Party, the whole party, this next week at the convention because no one is going to see the convention that doesn't go to Fox, which the head of ABC News said got to be one of the most stupid things he'd ever heard of. The money people are unhappy. Fox is making premium money because it's the only network that's going to be carrying the Republican thing, which means. If you're a liberal and you want to hear what the Republicans have to say in order to debunk them, you have to watch Fox. If you're a middle of the road that doesn't know much about Romney or Ryan, you have to watch Fox. And th but they're going to come in, they're going to have a, a minute or so break at the end of every hour to tell people what happened. And they think the news people said their job was to, to report news, not to support a political candidate. Uh, that's true. Yep. And new details emerge in the deadly New York City shooting. Well, and they keep talking about this fact that, that okay, I'm going to tell people again. I guarantee you that we went to a trade show where they said they are not firing people in the garment business, they are hiring people. They have never hired so many people in the last 20 years as they're hiring now because of the expansion of the garment industry. Well, we'll give you an example of how bad things are. Uh, American Apparel used to be everywhere at Magic. Now they got one tiny little booth. That's it, one tiny little booth with one person sitting at it. Mm -mm. And Biden is not going to the RNC convention after all. Yeah, because they found out if Biden is going to be a roving reporter, then the Republicans get to have a roving reporter during the Democratic Party. And what you really want to do is have Paul Ryan walking through the studio you know, with uh, representing the poll, talking to the Democrats out there and them being obnoxious. Because the tr difference is, they know the Republicans would be respectful to Biden because he's vice president and he's a long term senator. Right, and, it goes and, with, yeah. And they know he's getting old and he shows it all the time. And they want him to go out there and say stupid things. The more stupid things he says, the happier the Republicans would be. But the Democrats know that if Ryan goes out there, they're going to boo him, and they're going to hiss him, they're going to do everything they can, which makes them look bad and the Republicans look good. So, <laughs> Johnny Depp is not playing for the RNC after all. Oh uh, yeah, because he 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 went to a fundraiser. A lot of people went to fundraiser. Robert Downey Jr. went to a fundraiser. Johnny Depp went to a fundraiser. all these people that should have known better went to the fundraisers of the other party and when if you're because what they're doing is they're using their names you know so they support president obama that make any difference they you know because they, they had, were there they were there and if they're there you basically walk into the building and it says on the door of the building this you know this event is being taped for use and such and such and you grant us permission to do such so you can't go in without that. We do it all the time. We go in the buildings where we know they're filming, just like at a trade show we went to. They told people, it used to be no cameras of any type of any reason whatsoever, and now they got a thing saying well, the show is being taped uh, for uh, photographs, taped and all that stuff for later use, and by entering this facility you grant you rights perpetuity to go in. So. Mm -hmm. And Paul, Ryan, two supporters, I'm you. Yeah, I keep telling people that. I mean, here, okay, Ryan looks right in his Walmart clothes. Uh, Romney does not look right in clothes he's got at Walmart because uh, the, he, he, uh, he, Romney is not a jeans and a denim shirt guy, whereas, um, you know, Ryan is a de uh, jeans and denim shirt. He rolls his sleeves up. He looks like a working class person. And the prediction models look dismal for Obama. Uh, well, okay, Bill O'Reilly and others have been scoffing at, at Mora, Dick Morris over on Fox because he's been he telling people it doesn't make any difference what they're telling. These are registered voters. Registered voters don't vote. 
you go to the ones that have a history of voting and, and contact them when they're going to do it. The polls have not been wrong since Dewey. That is how long the polls have not been wrong. I mean, 1948 was the last time they made a mistake. On the, this is the final projection before the, uh, the first convention. All of them are showing a landslide for Romney, all on the same reason. Does anybody, BS says, does anybody know why they're now predicting a landslide for Romney over Obama, even though they don't like Romney and because uh, all the charisma that Obama has? Okay, BS says, have you got an answer? Does anybody get an answer out there? What? Because as Dick Morris said, we got Bill Clinton to say, it's the economy, stupid. If you're not voting, you are, you know, if you don't have a job, you're not likely to vote for the person that you, that cost you your job. That's the way it works. And they also, their own models, the Democratic Party models said they expect unemployment to go up to 9% next year because of George Bush and the Republicans. Oh, they also said the more they use George Bush and the Republicans, the more people distance themselves from Obama, and the more negative Obama goes, the more they're dissing himself from Obama. He's running a Chicago-style campaign that is tanking with his own party. Mm. And more Prince Harry photos may emerge, a UK publicist claims. Oh, those are just the, the, okay, the ones that are up now are just the photos from that party. There's the bachelorette party that he went to earlier. There is the doing laps for 5,000 people in a swimming pool that are also to be seen. Um, there's him drinking lots and lots and lots to be seen. So um, they're, they're, those are just, though the public photos haven't got out yet. The private ones are out, but the public photos, which are equally as bad, are not, they're there on, I mean, everybody in the place is taking photographs of Harry well, drinking and swimming. Well, okay, part of it is, if you have 5,000 people, how many of them probably have cell phones? All of them. They said that uh, Harry could be tossed out of the, he's a good one, you know, his family is basically the charge of the military, but he could be thrown out of the military for conduct on becoming an officer. Oh! Yeah, they said that uh, it doesn't make any difference that he was there representing the British government and he basically, as an officer in the British uh, re military rescue corps, he basically disgraced the uniform that he had. Uh, and, and at all times, even though he's a reservist, he is an officer and a high-ranking officer. I mean, remember all those really ugly-looking uniforms they wear? Those are officers' uniforms in the British military. Ooh. Uh, and what's the best way to avoid mosquito bites? Um, well, first of all, mosquitoes are attracted to, to sweat. If you don't, they're basically what it is, it's just the salt and the sweat that they're attracted to. If you don't, if you wear long sleeve clothes, uh, they're not attracted to your arm. You wear long pants and long sleeve clothes, and you basically they don't go for necks and faces. Oh, interesting. Yeah. And the hidden risk of getting a tattoo. Well, yeah, because um, okay, we know we actually know somebody that just had all their tattoos ta uh, brightened up because uh, the older you get. The, okay, Arnold Schwarzenegger and Sylvester Stallone are perfect examples of tattoos when they were younger and more muscular and now the tattoos are sort of, uh, mm -hmm. you know, they're faded and they don't look good. So they're having tattoo work done on the tattoos, which you really don't want to do when you get to be older. South African hippo stuck in swimming pool dies. Yeah, because you can't, uh, you, it, hippos weigh a lot and you have to get a crane in to get the hippo out. People don't understand, hippos don't breathe water, they breathe air, and they can't tread water forever. And Isaac targets Haiti, and Florida's still in harm's way. Yeah, because it's coming right for the Republican convention. Oh, it is? But they said it won't make any difference, because uh, the, convention is, uh, the convention is away from where there would be any hurricane problems. It just means you're not going to go party on the beaches of Tampa, you're just going to have to, but as, okay, what do Southern Californians do if it's bad weather? What? They all go inside, so guess what they're going to be doing? They'll be inside spending money in Tampa instead of being out at the beaches, which the people will say, storm, storm. <laughs> um, Paul Ryan favors asparagus over cake and Obama. Yeah, well, yeah, Paul Ryan, uh, uh, okay, uh, okay. Uh, working class people like to eat greens. 
people like Romney and George Bush hate asparagus and cauliflower and all. All that stuff that's really good for them, they hate Brussels sprouts like a patient. They do? They don't like that stuff. Mm -hmm. And a Monty Bubbleism from the Mark Twain and the Animal Kingdom.